I love the story of blind Bartimaeus. I love the story, and I want to share another version of it with you today. It goes like this. Well, old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, blind, blind Bartimaeus stood on the way. Old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, crying, Oh, Lord, have mercy on me. You all have it in your bulletins. Go ahead, open it up and sing it with me, all right? Well, old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, blind, blind Bartimaeus stood on the way. Old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, crying, oh, Lord, have mercy on me. In my God's Bible, the word proclaims, Christ was a healing, the crippled and the lame. He gave to the poor and the needy bread, a healing the sick and a raising the dead. And when he came to Galilee, he passed by a man who could not see. The man was blind, he was blind from birth. They tell me that his name was Blind Bartimaeus. Well, old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, blind, blind Bartimaeus stood on the way. Old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, crying, oh, Lord, have mercy on me. Bartimaeus just wouldn't take no for an answer. The people around Jesus were telling him to be quiet, Quit making such a fuss. Why would the Messiah pay attention to a blind beggar at the side of the road who could be a more lowly example of humanity? Why indeed? Why would God pay attention to an ordinary person with ordinary problems? Why would Jesus attend to this social outcast, to this clearly marginalized person. When Bartimaeus heard that the Lord was nigh, he fell on his knees and began to cry, O thou man from Galilee, crying, Great God Almighty, have mercy on me, crying, O Lord, Mary's baby, O Lord, son of David, Oh, Lord, bleeding lamb, Lord, from in Bethlehem, crying, Oh, Lord, Mary's baby, Oh, Lord, son of David, Oh, Lord, bleeding lamb, Lord, from in Bethlehem. Bartimaeus took a chance. He committed himself to reaching Jesus. He kept calling out for Jesus, asking for him to have mercy when all of the people around him were telling him to be quiet. Why bother calling out? Just be quiet. Be content with your life as it is. Be content. Do we do that? Are we settling Are we going through the motions in our lives, staying in our place at the side of the road, accepting our lot? Are we doing that? This this story challenges us, calls us to be bold like Bartimaeus. Put yourself forward. Reach out. Call out to Jesus and you will be heard. You will encounter God. You will know God's love. So much of the time we go on living with our own blindness. We don't understand God. We don't know how to live that life that Jesus talks about. The life that he calls eternal life. That life that is overflowing with God's love. That that so fills us with God's love that it drives us into the world to do God's work. It so overflows with God's love that it overflows into the world 
We just don't know how to do that. And so we settle for our lot in life. We settle for not knowing. We settle for not seeing. But not Bartimaeus. He kept on crying out. And when my Lord, and my Lord, he stopped, he turned around, he saw blind Bartimaeus on the ground. He touched his eyes with the palm of his hand. Blind Bartimaeus saw like a natural man, crying, thank God, Mary's baby, thank God, son of David, thank God, bleeding lamb, Lord from in Bethlehem. Bartimaeus responded to Jesus' love and healing with gratitude. Thank God, son of David. He reached out for God's love. He called out for healing, and he received his sight. He came to see where once he had been blind, and now he was crying. Crying, thank God, Mary's baby, thank God, son of David, thank God, bleeding lamb, Lord from in Bethlehem. Now, this church, this church here is named after another story that takes place at the side of a road. A man was traveling, and he was robbed and left, stripped and left for dead on the side of the road, and some very important people came by, and they moved to the other side of the road to avoid the man. And then along comes a Samaritan. This good Samaritan sees the man, and he has compassion. He has pity. And so he tended to the man's wounds, and he took him to an end. He even paid the end keeper to care for him until he could return. Well, those important people, a Levite and a priest, were blind to the man on the side of the road. Maybe they didn't want to touch him. Um, I've heard that maybe they didn't want to touch him because he, he could be dead. What if he really was dead? And if he was dead, then they would have to go and go through elaborate rituals to be able to enter into the temple again. Or maybe they just didn't want to take the time. Or perhaps this man's suffering just plain didn't rise above the noise of life. It, it was just part of their everyday existence, a life full of suffering. And so they missed seeing his humanity and his need because he was not their problem, or he was someone else's problem, or I don't know, maybe they thought he deserved what he got. I mean, what if he was an illegal alien, or if he was an unhoused person, or if he was a Gentile? Whatever the reason, the Levite and the priest, these important people, were blind to his need, blind to his humanity, blind to the image of God in that man lying, suffering on the side of the road. They needed healing to see, and they didn't even know it. They were as blind as Bartimaeus. Now, we can help each other to see. When one of us is inspired to help those in need, it inspires others. It inspires others among us to do the same. When one of us is suffering, others can give love and support. Now, that might mean a visit. It might mean a get well card. It might mean going and building a ramp in front of someone's house or or giving them a meal in a time of need. Because together we are stronger, more capable of defying the forces that tell us to be quiet. We will not be quiet. We will know God. We will call out to Jesus like Bartimaeus. We will be Christ's heart and hands in the world. We will follow old blind Bartimaeus' example. 
Well, old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, blind, blind Bartimaeus stood on the way. Old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, crying, O Lord, have mercy on me. Crying, thank God, Mary's baby, thank God, son of David, thank God, bleeding lamb, Lord from in Bethlehem. Well, old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, blind, blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, crying, O Lord, have mercy on me. Well, old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, blind, blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, old blind Bartimaeus stood on the way, crying, O Lord, have mercy on me.